hello friends today in this tutorial i'll be showing you that how to scrape uh, or how to fetch uh, instagram user details and display it on inside your browser so we have a simple form here here you can submit the instagram username so basically if you go to instagram and search for any sort of username let me take my example and put the username of this so it will fetch this name biography and all this information profile image all that stuff so if you just see here if i plug this click get details and now it will show you these details total number of post is 12 you can count here total post is 12 here you can see and it is displaying the biography the same biography which is written here and the full name you can see so the profile image is not displayed here so if you open this in new tab you will see the image is also displayed you can take example of any username let me change the username to this username click get details and now you will see you can see that so basically it will only fetch the first 12 posts and it will show you to you can see that if you change it to So this is the same information it is fetching here you will see that so i will be showing you how to build this inside node.js and express and uh, some we are using some ejs template as well for this i have written a complete blog post on my blog website i have given the link in the video description so just go to the video description and download all the source code and now to get started guys i will delete all this and start from scratch so first of all you need to install express so this is a brand new project so what you need to do is that you need to install express ejs and then this instagram dash scraping and this is a dependency so install these three dependencies so basically if you go to npmjs.com so the dependency is instagram dash scraping so this is a dependency you will see and now after installing these dependencies guys you can just create your index.js file here in the root directory so here you can import express so you can require the express module start your express application like this declare a port number so we will be running this on 5000 so this will be app dot so app dot listen so it will be listening on this port number so console log So app is listening on port 5000 so now we can make a simple get request so when we load the page we need to display a template so just declare a views folder views and inside this store index.ejs so which we have installed so ejs this is a template engine so this will contain a simple template here we will have a simple form action will be get profile and the method will be post and here we will be having input type text so name will be the username and then we will have a simple submit button to submit the form value will be get profile so now we need to set the view engine first of all so app dot set view engine ejs now we can use response dot render and load this template like this so if you now make this node more index.js so it will start this application 
so if you just open localhost 5000 you will see your form ready here so now we need to make that post request so app dot post get profile request response so now to get that uh, username we need to include a middleware which is body parser so require body parser here app dot use url encoded extended to false and body parser json so now you will be able to get the value which the user has submitted so simply request or body dot username so now if you submit any sort of username click get profile you will see it will be printed out in the console so now we simply need to get the profile so if you search for this package instagram scraping here it has its own documentation which is a pretty good documentation so we are using this method here simply we can include this so at the very top we can include the module ig require instagram scraping so now we can use this method so instead of passing the static username we can pass the dynamic username request or body dot username so now we can print out the result so once again if i submit the username click get profile so you will see all these details will be printed out on the screen so total number of posts the biography this is the number of followers full name all this stuff so we can print out this profile pic url ht so we can print out on the screen so what we can do is that we can send out send this information to the template so we can say index and then we can say we can pass the data object to result so when we load for the very first time the data will be empty like this and now coming back to the template we can print out this data so inside our result div we can print out this data so for printing out inside h3 we will say total post this will be equal to this is a syntax in ejx in order to print out a variable so this will be data dot because we are passing the data here you can see data variable so data dot if you check the uh, object which is returning to us which is data dot total so this will be data dot total and close this like this and now we will print out the biography of the person so biography so this will be equal to data dot user dot biography and for the full name this will be similar the syntax data dot user dot full underscore name so these three information we are printing let me check if it is working or not so refresh it so it is saying cannot read property or biography let me see let me check So if you go to the video description link i have written the complete block uh, source code let me check why it is happening so oh sorry we need to check first of all if the data is available to us so right here inside we need to check for the if condition right here so we will check if the data is available to us then only we will run so just surround this and uh, close this and now if this will work here so simply 
so it is saying they could not find the magic tag so just replace here this percentage sign that's it refresh it now click get profile so you will see this three information printed out total post biography and full name you can change the username to any username of your choice you can see that so now this is working for every Instagram username and lastly you can also print out the profile image if you want to inside the image tag source it will it will not be displayed because you are using local host so you need to be kept in mind data dot user dot uh, profile pick I think this is the close the image tag let me see if it's printing out so if you check the documentation it is there inside the sorry profile pick URL so this is the thing profile pick URL so if you refresh it click get profile so you will see your image is not printed out because you are using localhost so simply click open image in new tab you can also download this also inside your computer like this so this is the profile image you can also download or oh sorry view it inside HD as well so the images is also in HD quality so just underscore HD So now you will find the two images. This is the HD one. It is quite bigger. And uh, now this is JPG. So in this way, guys, you can fetch the Instagram user details alongside with the profile picture. And uh, inside Node.js and in JavaScript, I have given all the source code in the video description. So just download it. And please hit the like button, subscribe the channel. And I will be seeing you in the next video.